Right, I've had this IKEA glass table for years now, and as you can see, it's had its fair share of wear and tear. It's covered in scratches, and it shows up fingerprints really easily. So I wanna try and fix it up, because it's still a good table at the end of the day. I've thought about turning it into a frosted glass table. Now I know traditionally this would be done with a sandblaster, but I'm gonna see if I can do it by hand, or at least do it with an electric sander. Let's see how it goes. So in theory, now I've got the table outside, I should be able to just sand it and it should be frosted. I'm gonna start off with 120 grit. I've also got 80 grit and 240 grit. Basically, the lower the grit number, the coarser or rougher the sandpaper is gonna be. So I'm gonna start with the middle one, 120, and see how that goes. I know we're all used to wearing a mask now, but this is a job I definitely want to be wearing a respirator for. Last thing I wanna do is breathe in any of this dust. And of course, eye protection is a must as well. Let's try the 80 grit. Trouble is, of course, I didn't take into account that this is tough and glass. The sandpaper I've got just isn't hard enough to be able to scratch the surface. These scratch lines are me putting a lot of pressure on and at this level, it's not gonna frost. Ideally, this would just be a light sanding and it would frost the surface, but I tried anyway. Well, that wasn't the plan. I just had to put a potty plant on that bit. So I wanted to see if it would be easy to just sand the glass table and make it frosted. And the answer is no. 